so that is the best that we got in the latest round of summons that we just did so you saw that we got nyx and got some very good epics in there along the way to try to play around with i've been summoning here um here and on uh since i've been completing some of the some of the storyline quests and i also did manage to get another legendary but it's a legendary that at least in the beta nobody knew what to do with or they even wanted to bother building him um so we do have three now and uh it's uh it's cratch and he is uh, a legendary with a very weird kit it's really hard to find him a home to put him in a team but i will use him here in the early game i'm actually thinking of taking him to 50 and just leaving him there but he can certainly help us a little bit maybe he can help us with gr3 at the beginning stages a little bit and then we'll go from there so what have I been working on so far? So besides Nyx and getting her up to 50, I just uh, promoted her three times. We still have our Nocturne that we got uh, since last, uh, when I lost Sayu. We've been working with Breen. Breen has been our marksman. We did uh, promote her. We ranked her up. I've been using Iona. She's a very good mage uh, for, the, for the, um, the battles. We got Mary. Mary is a very good mage that is not particular for damage. It's just slow things down. So then you can get your attackers to do what they need to do. I've been, I've been using Oseren uh, here and there. This is another epic that I just got. There was some uh, content that I needed two defenders just so I could put somebody there to take some damage and I would give him some levels. So I'm using him. He's not, he's not highly ranked. On the tier list but i'm finding some use for him here on the early i finally got a second healer uh leveled up kind of leveled up but i am using a second healer now in this and day and uh that's that's pretty much the extent of it i managed to use laurel in a dungeon here and there but uh that's not going to given the mages they already have um she's not gonna get built up as much as she is uh, in terms of the fusions here, uh, given that I have Nessa Day, I'm not going to come for the hero fusion of uh, Light Luck. I think uh, if you're struggling with trying to get a second fusion, this would be the guy to come and get him with. I already have a copy of Theo when don't want to spend too much resources trying to get more copies of him to, uh, to awaken him and that'll come down the line. The one that I'm 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 going to spend the resources and it looks like I might do it sooner rather than later is to come and get Libyan since I haven't summoned her. I do have uh, copies of the rares and I'm gonna give up Rex even though I've been using him a lot. I'm gonna give up Rex and I'm gonna come and get Libyan. So that's something that I'm gonna be doing now that we're beefing up and uh, we're gonna be getting some energy pots to continue on with this here i am in the hero's path now i'm uh clear stage six in gear three uh gear rate three which is kind of where i'm stuck at the moment and i just need to level up more marksmen and maybe some mages i do have voltus here mo mo would be a great um great to get in your account and if you do have him i would suggest that you do level him up but i gotta thicken up some uh, marksman to help me uh, clear that and if i do i can start getting legendary pieces i've been trying to work on gear raid one too so we're pushing we're pushing we just finished nine we're gonna get into 10 i'm hoping to clear that when we next log in and that's where we are uh, in terms of the campaign which is really what you're initial so there were gonna be two probably two stages where you're gonna hit like a check you know where you're gonna have to revamp your your um you're gonna have to revamp your squad probably uh you know gear them up a little bit uh bring some of the gear up to eight if it's epic so the, the way that i can kind of form in this is at least for these harder stages 
as you can see here i'm bringing in two defenders and for this occasion i had a, a fighter in there too bring in the marksman bring in your mages uh, these these three are doing the damage for me so is iona mary kind of slows things down so it's kind of like a squad here just kind of put things in check uh, and also do deal the damage but then you can see that i have two healers in case i do need a healer so let me run let me run 515 for you to kind of get an idea as to how i set things up for this stage in case you are going to tackle it so essentially what i decided to do is instead of putting the defenders and the fighters right at the at the at the course i put them ahead and so then i was able to place one of the healers here you see my fighter here he's done very good so i put the healer here to cover this area right there and then you can see i now have my marksman mary and uh when um uh, nocturne uh, so now we're covering and we're helping the defenders a little bit put iona here on top away from the poison but she also did some damage here is the main boss so there is mary i use her slow so then my marksman and my mate just could do damage here is nyx on the bottom so now we're just waiting for them to push over and these two are pretty much going to do some damage before they get to rex and there you go so that was 515 now so 516 required a little bit of a setup at the beginning and i took an um advantage of nix's uh, long range so once you promote nix uh, pass two you can they take advantage of the of her long range so you're gonna see this very annoying boss that can steal half uh, the health of your any champion that it targets to heal itself so here so as you can see here i put next here and her range can actually extend out to here if you place anywhere near in or you place in these tiles here that he covers you will this boss will just kill you that's the first thing that i did i tried to cover the bottom here you can see that i was able to put rex in time to block any entrance so there he's doing the damage you saw nix just take care of the boss so once that happened it was all about positioning and how these were entering the battle so first you can see all the arrows point up so we have to help rex and that's what i was setting up there there is mary just to slow things down here are my damage dealers and Brin is hanging down here covering the bottom So here's where I put in my second tank to hold things up because these waves were actually going to go down here. You, I think you saw the arrows. So that's kind of the... That's why I'm trying to get at least two defenders or fighters, you know, the mix. A very good mix establishing your, your comp here so you can cover all bases when needed. There's Brain doing my damage. Mary slowing things down. So that's kind of the standard setup of how things are going right now so so far so good we're getting um we're getting a lot of xp so the next thing to do will be uh trying to do chapter seven here try to cover and unlock the nest and next xp xp level we want to unlock that because we can get down to stage six here we can get a greater drop on the xp we get more we level up the champions that's let me give you here let me give you an idea of how i have things geared so far so here is my um uh, nocturne my mage so kind of gear that he has you know there were some legendary pieces here that uh, that we were able to acquire so we put it on we will put it on him i think we farmed this one has some hp bonus which is fine i just want to keep him my dying alive attack bonus here 
critical damage there for now just so he can do some damage when it comes to nyx it was essential you know just give her attack which is fine that's the, the gear that we have some survivability some attack i just want her to do some damage here is bring uh, epic pieces and uh you know i'm going for the attack here hp there's some attack bonus on this one give her a little bit of crit rate but mostly because he had attack bonus here attack and attack b unfortunately this was a bad roll so this piece won't last too long but we give her some attack and hp on the top here i'm not sure if there's anything later that can give her uh yeah more attack but there's some crit right here well i'll think about that uh so um when it comes to attack bonus right now versus attack it really it really i'm trying to do the math as to how much attack bonus would add uh, for now flat works just as well as attack bonus but once you start getting them more stats and you increase to the to the base then yes uh, attack bonus is going to be more beneficial right now i'm happy with where i am i'm happy with the selections that i've received nocturne and nyx are very good legendaries especially for now then later on in the in the end game or the mid game end game then i can start focusing and doing a little bit more selective summoning especially for the champions that i do know will eventually come into the game in some way shape or form given that they were in the forerunners beta uh, servers so with that thank you for tuning in. if you have any questions please post them below hit like and subscribe and i will see you all in the next episode